Google View Office model is available right now inside NADEN, and there are already profiles that make millions and millions of views. For example, this profile creates um, biblical videos, and one of their videos gained 27 million views. Another profile which is very popular right now is about the ZAT which is making vlogs, and again, these videos get millions and millions of views. Also, what they do only, they publish the videos published with VO3. And now we can automate the entire process with this entire automation. And if you don't know what is happening right now, VO3 is the latest video model that produces highly professional, realistic, or even unusual um, videos from scratch. So here, for example, this Yeti, um, I don't know, he's holding like the camera on the bamboo and he's like, you know, I'm showing his entire life. So it's pretty cool. It gets millions of likes and millions of views. So in this video, I will be showing you step by step how to build this entire automation that creates for you viral VO3 videos. So for an example, here we've got two AI agents to create an idea and a prompt. There, we just trigger this entire um, application. So we create the VO3 video, we get it. And at the end, we just store it to Google Sheets. Also, we can use this automation and for an example, publish the content on TikTok and just do it within seconds. And in case you don't know what NIDEN is and why you see a lot of content about it, it's an automation tool that is quite um, right now popular due to its capabilities. So it's similar to Zapier, Made.com. Nevertheless, it allows us to do much more. So in general, we'll do everything here inside this video with NIDEN. Nevertheless, I will show you everything step by step how to do this entire project. So with all that being said, let's dive in. And even before I show you how I build this entire automation step by step, um, remember to check out our AI Agents Accelerator. So this is our AI automation community, and the price for now is $29 per month, and we've got 75 members, however the price rises at, at 100 members. Um, also, in the classroom, um, you've got a lot of resources. For an example, 20 hours and I then course. Um, you've got a lot of templates, plus 100 templates. Additionally, you've got the resources from the YouTube videos. So for an example, also for this specific video, we've got VO3 video generator. So I put there the prompt, the system message, um, like, you know, all of the information. Additionally, this template that we can download and, you know, just import inside NADEN. So after you do this, you've got this entire automation set up. So finally, with all that being said, let me show you how I built this entire project. And there I used um, the trigger, which is schedule. So I run this automation, you know, every day at midnight. Then what I've done, um, I um, actually picked a agent that generates for me the video title. And now let's dive deep. So for an example, what I have here inside, I've got a prompt and system message. The prompt is pretty simple. So generate me an idea to create the content about biblical characters speaking to the camera and making a vlog. However, the system message is quite, I can say, complex because we've got the purpose, we've got actually the thing to prompt, output requirements, and um, here, you know, we've got um, all of the details. So what we say, you generate viral short form video ideas inspired by biblical characters or scenes styled like modern TikTok vlogs. These should feel personal, emotional, and often humorous. It's very important, yeah, so sometimes even these videos are ridiculous. Nevertheless, it's really catchy. Think tool prompt. So we are using the think tool, output requirements. So for an example, we would like to get the caption, idea, environment, status, and so on. And also we've got here examples. So this is the first AI agent. For this AI agent, we also require a specific output format because we are using output parser. So we want to define that, hey, we would like to create the caption, you know, idea, environment, and status. So we want to get these variables. It looks like this. And in general, everything you've got explained um, inside our community. So we can just copy and paste the system message, you know, and then just um, use it for your agent. Also the prompt and output parser. The next A agent is to generate the prompt. So what we do inside. In the prompt, we, we say, Create a prompt for the VO3 video based on the following information. So we provide the idea and environment um, from our generate video idea a agent. And what I do, I just simply drag and drop this entire um, yeah, box and I put it here, okay? So you see JSON output idea. It's pretty straightforward. And again, with the environment, I've done the same thing, all right? 
Also for this AA agent, we've got the system message, which is pretty complex. So inside what we have, we've got a system message, VO3 prompt structured guidelines. So there uh, we describe each prompt should be natural, cinematic and visually immersive, including scene description, character focus, ca camera movement, time of the day lighting, atmosphere texture and so on. And we've got all of the description right here, example output, input, and you know, it's so, so cool. Additionally, remember inside the YouTube resources, we've got different templates such as TikTok video machine, which is pretty complex. Actually here, you've got a lot of different prompts as you can see at the end, um, you can download the template in JSON format right there. And um, also what we have here, we've got YouTube videos posting system. So, you know, feel free to check it out, no pressure. However, for now, I think the price is really low comparing to the value we provide. Nevertheless, let's move forward because we have and um, then the system message that we can copy and paste. However, after it, uh, when we go over there, um, you can see we've got our template um, to save the content information inside Google Sheets. And there, uh, again, inside our community, you can just open this link and you should see this entire template. So what we have, idea, caption, status, environment, and video URL. Inside the status, you've got to create and create it. So simply, you can go over here, open this link and click on file and make a copy. So when I open this Google Sheets note, inside you can see we've got our um, Google credential, here the operation, which is up and row, um, our documents of our sheet and there the specific fields. So idea, caption, status, environment. So simply what I've done, I've dragged for an example idea and dropped here. And by this way, actually also we need to provide um, yeah, the sentence, um, actually the code, which is first, then it should work. What it does, if you have multiple items inside your automation and it then doesn't know which one um, should be the first. So you just simply, um, instead of the item, you provide the first and it works. Nevertheless, um, we save the data inside Google Sheets. Next, what we have, we create the video with the HTTP request. And for this case, we are not using VO3 directly, however, the platform that operates on it. So in that case, we are using full AI that allows us to connect with VO3 model. And here in general, I've created some videos. So if I go over to the playground, I can see that um, here in the requests, I created some videos um, they are visible right there. Nevertheless, let me show you um, how it looks like. So the entire HTTP request. So the method is post, URL is this one URL, and um, you can copy it from here. So we've got everything right there to HTTP requests. Um, there we've got generic credential type, header authentication. And with the header authentication, you just need to type, let me show you. You just need to type the authorization. And inside, you just need to, um, I will show you how you need to provide there the value. You just type key, and then you provide your API um, key, okay? Um, so this is the entire format. Um, let me show you. This is the entire format, um, what you need to provide right there. I don't want to um, choose it for the expression because I've got my API key and I don't want you to see that. Okay. But this is the format you need to provide. Um, after you do this, you save and then you're ready to go. So in general, um, you click on send body um, you click on the body content, which is row and content type application JSON. And what you do, you simply provide this specific output. So in general, we can drag and drop it here. Um, so let's go over right there. Uh, we can provide it here. So let's provide our um, prompt. And there, um, you know, we just provide this body and we are ready to go. We can test the step. I've already done it. So you can see my video is being created. Um, then what do we do? We wait. 10 minutes. We need to give time for the tool to generate for us a video. I've got 10 seconds um, for the purpose of this video and from the fact the video is already created. Nevertheless, uh, what you can do, you can set up the entire automation with 10 seconds and um, actually time frame, and then, you know, just change for 10 minutes when you create it. But what you do after waiting 10 minutes is to, um, yeah, you get the video. Another, you create another HTTP request. Um, I named it get video. So the, so the method is get, and there, this is the specific URL you need to copy and paste. So also you can get it from there. Um, we've got the authentication, which is generic credential type, header authentication, so the same. So in general, you know, you've got even explained how the authentication works. So you type the authorization key, your API key, 
Um, and there, this is pretty enough. You get the video. And at the end, you store the video inside uh, your Google Sheets. So it simply looks like this. And after the video is generated, everything is done. Like you've got the status which is created and all of the data you store inside this application. And the last very important fact for now is the pricing. Because for the day of recording this video, this is June 10, 2025, um, actually the cost, um, as you can see here, will be 50, 50 cents or 75 cents with audio on um, for each second of the video, which is a huge price. So for example, a five seconds video with audio on will cost you $3.75. And I can say actually, in some cases, it's not that big price. For an example, if you get millions of views like this Yeti vlogger, you know, so you can invest for sure and um, you will get a lot of in return. Nevertheless, um, in case of just creating a lot of these videos, the cost is pretty high. And you need to mention that this tool was released a few days ago, okay? So the price for sure now will be huge. Ha however, maybe if you're watching this video right now, the video costs much lower or even it's pretty cheap. So I think it will take some time um, actually to change its pricing. Nevertheless, again, if you're watching this video, the pricing for sure could have changed. Nevertheless, for now, this is everything. Thank you for watching this entire material. Remember to check out our AA Agents Accelerator. Again, we've got a lot of resources. So here, um, you know, we've got a lot of exclusive templates, um, plus 20 hours and then course. We've got the classroom, you know, all of the resources make that come. Even you've got... 30 day A automation ag agency roadmap. Uh, for now, the price for me is pretty low, $29 per month. I'm um, like, we increase the price um, soon. Nevertheless, again, feel free to check it out. No pressure. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you for watching this material again. Leave the like for the YouTube algorithm. Click the subscribe button and I will see you in the next material.